All right, joining us in west of Tulsa, Al with his Corvair. This is a beautiful car, what you've done with this. Tell us about it. What year is it? It's a 1965 Chevy Corvair Corsa. Now, the Corsa was the first year that it came out in 65. It designated the 140 horsepower motor. It also came with more instrument gauges on the uh, dashboard and, of course, a four-speed. Mine's a little bit different. You'll notice there's a battery up front here yeah. with some uh, related wiring. That's for my electric air conditioning system. So what I've done is besides modified the interior a little bit, I've got pro car seats that make it a lot more comfortable. Then I've upgraded the uh, gauges on the instrument with auto meter. The evaporator unit right there uh, is for the cold air conditioning. Yeah, you change it just a little bit. Just a little <laughs> bit, a couple of modifications here and there. Yeah, just a little bit of modifications here yeah, in the back as well. Yeah. Talk, boy, talk about this monster. Yeah, so this is the uh, 140 platform motor. Uh, originally had four one barrel carburetors on it. So what we did is we found some intake manifolds and had some heads that were stock. We had those completely machined to be able to adapt the intake manifolds. These are triple 46 IDA Weber carburetors that we installed. The motor's 40 thousandths over. Everything's balanced inside. I didn't actually have it blueprinted, but it's near that edge. So originally, what was the horsepower on the original car, and what is it now? 140 horsepower was the original, and I'm now putting out 235. Wow. With 150 pounds of torque on this little on this light on body. this little car that wow. weighs 2,100 pounds, so you can get going on it then. Yeah, right? it'll yeah. it'll get moving, and then to assist in that, these cars were always under geared. Yeah. Um, this had a from the factory a 355 gear ratio, and they did make cars with 327s. Those normally had the automatics, so that meant that I was turning high RPMs on the freeway doing modern speeds. Sure. So I now have a 308 gear ratio in it. So now I'm doing 2,100 RPM, doing 70 miles an hour on the freeway. Let you cruise a little bit better. Which, which yeah, makes it cruise nice. a little bit better. Yeah. Um, well, thank you so much. I thank appreciate you. it. We're going to see you back here again, right? You're out Absolutely. here? Absolutely. This is the Ventura Cars and Coffee. All right, Al, thanks for joining us in Western Tulsa. Appreciate it.